Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, hello. You guys ready to get started? Let me see those airplane emojis in the chat. Midnight Maverick with the 10 month YouTube subscription, man. Thank you so much for being a member, my friend. You've always been a huge supporter of the channel and I just respect you. I'm saluting to you right now. Thank you so much, my friend, for all your help, all your love, support. Been amazing. Micah Boy Productions is ready to go. James ATX is ready to go. You made it for this one. Yes, you are, man. Welcome to the stream, bro. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good to be back and happy Friday. And it is the first of the month. Also, happy 4th of July. Independence Day here in the United States. And as you can see, we are in the Top Gun aircraft carrier. Yes, this is straight out of the Top Gun DLC. And it is now in the world map for us to fly to. We're actually here in the Florida Keys and it is actively moving. Like my camera, when I stop moving my camera, the, the carrier just keeps going. It also has a few uh, supporter battleships around it. So pretty darn sweet. Very, very cool. So we'll be landing on it. We're gonna try out try out our skills today on the carrier again, this time in live multiplayer. That's gonna be a lot of fun. You can say it looks pretty amazing. Definitely join us if you can. Now you need to have three mods installed, and I also have some bad news for you. The first you have oh look a cruise ship. Uh, first you need to have the Top Gun DLC installed, free DLC from the marketplace. Second, you need to have uh, the Moving Carrier mod, link is down in the description on YouTube, so go get that. Third, uh, you don't need to, but it's recommended that you have the Super Warrior mod. It's a uh, modded F-18 Hornet, the F-18 Super Warrior mod. It makes the F-18 so much better. Um, you actually have like, really cool uh, uh, condensation effects. You can actually have smoke now, the aerobatics. So it's very, very cool. So I definitely recommend getting those two mods. Uh, or yeah, both of those on our flightsim.to for free. Everything you see here today is for free. Absolutely, my friends. We'll bring the music down just a little bit. Yes, sir, yes, sir. There it is. But yes, get the mods if you can. Now, the bad news is, the bad news is that uh, this is a moving carrier. So it's actually an object on the world map that is actively moving as soon as you spawn in. So if you spawn in on the moving carrier mod, your carrier will sadly not be in the same location as mine. They both start in the same location, but once you load in, that carrier starts moving and it will not stop moving. Uh, so we've been trying to find a way to like get it in sync, but so far there's no way to get it in sync that i found so i'm just gonna do a few touch and goes here on the carrier deck do some practice and then once we uh kind of prove that i can do it <laughs> hopefully i can uh we'll probably fly out over to the florida keys area or homestead air force base and then we can meet up together and do some formation flying some dog fighting some aerobatics some uh some air show stuff so that's the plan today but as you can see the carrier looks great i remember when i got the top gun dlc did the landing challenge the most disappointing part of the landing challenge was the fact that they did not insert the uh this carrier into the world map by default i was like what the heck <laughs> i was really upset about it um and it was a big letdown but now we have it in the world map this is what we wanted all we need now is for it to be in sync but great modeling now we can actually really appreciate what they've done here uh with the actual carrier itself i mean obviously it's microsoft flight sim it looks amazing i love all the 3d people in the correct uh, color jackets and uniforms. You can see lots of uh, ground equipment, air start units, uh, push tugs, cones, helicopters, um, a bunch of F 18s. I'm not sure why they didn't fold the wings on the F 18s here. They should have folded these wings, um, but it looks very well, very, very good. I don't think you can get inside of this thing. So we can get inside. Oh, we can. Nothing in there, but we can't get inside. Uh, do they have a rotating. Yeah, there's nothing animated. I thought they might have like a, a radar on here that animates, but yeah, it doesn't animate. It's just static. That's all good. Yeah, but it looks really good. It looks really good. I mean, it's, I'm glad we finally have been able to take it out of 
the game mode and bring it in the world and the world map so we can actually really appreciate it for what it really is. So this is our jet right here, the one with the folded wings. We're in the F-18 Super Warrior, as I said. Again, the only, uh, and I can kind of explain the differences between this and the regular default plane real quick. I'm gonna read it off of flightsim.to so you guys can understand uh, what is the difference between this and the default plane. I'm sure you're, you're curious. Thank you, James, our gold member. <laughs> oh man, thank you, bro. Let me see, how, is this your first, are you new? New, uh, no, four months being a gold member on the Blue Arrow Royal family. Thank you so much, my friend, James. And thank you again, Midnight Maverick. And big shout out to all of our YouTube uh, members. Thank you guys for your continued support. You really do keep the channel going. Yeah, no, <laughs> no moving radar, literally unplayable. I got you, Keith. Also, there is a working LSO. Where is it at? Here it is. Here's the ball, where they call it, say call the ball. Here's where the ball is. Very cool. The lights are not really in the sink, but you know, it, it does its thing. Rudy Salt, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Zelman, hello, welcome to the stream as well. But yeah, this actually works, which is pretty cool. So we get to see that when we get to try. Hopefully we can uh, get it to work. But yeah, let me go ahead and explain before we get started really quickly what the uh, difference of the Super Warrior mod versus the default Super Hornet. Um, so that we can all understand the, the difference. I already hear some engines flying around us right now. It's going to get really epic today. I am looking forward to it. We're going to kill the music. And we'll enjoy the sounds of the F-18 engine as it flies by here. Okay, so the difference between the F-18 Super Warrior and the Super Hornet. Oh, Sam. Okay, you guys keep... <laughs> James! Let's see nothing but butter. Nothing but butter, James. I got it just for you, bro. Thank you so much again, bro. So much. I can't thank you enough. I'm so sad you couldn't make it to our stream yesterday. We had so much fun. In the Kit Fox, like I legit was dreaming about that plane. That's how much I love it now. It, it might be my favorite plane. You know, it's a good plane when you have dreams about it. Oh wait, anyways. So, the Super Warrior, for one, it has fuel tanks. I couldn't believe the default plane didn't have freaking fuel tanks. But uh, yes, we have fuel tanks. I think. How do I do it? So let's go max fuel, and boom. Now our aircraft has fuel tanks. Very simple thing, but it's. It adds a lot to it. You can actually travel far. I, I don't know if they changed the actual fuel capacity, but at least you can now see we have fuel tanks. Uh, they also added wingtip vertices effect, which I think we already have. A leading edge vertices effect of vapor cone for sonic barrier, which is always already something that is came out of our uh, current update. Let me go to V4 features. Uh, it is a completely separate aircraft, so we can have the Hornet and the Super Warrior together. Uh, it actually comes with its own carrier. We're not on that carrier, but it does come with its own carrier. Uh, the, the, I think the launch bar works. The cattle, the uh, the hook works. They've changed a lot of stuff. Uh, they've added aerobatic smoke. That's one of my favorite things. Engine exhaust effect on afterburner. Burn is very cool. Um, and they also turned off the contrails. It sounds like. So yeah, very cool. So um, really, really like what they've done. If you want to know more about it, link is in the description. So let's get started. And I'm going to save some time. I could start it myself, but I'm just going to do it the easy way. I'm going to control E. So also, while we're starting engines up, we have a friend of mine with us today. And his name is Aviation360. And he is on voice chat with us. He's going to be flying with us in formation today. Again, we were not able to get the um, carriers in sync. So sadly, I will not be able to watch him land and I won't be able to watch other people land either. Definitely a letdown. But uh, we'll have some fun later on the stream. So let me go ahead and bring him into the chat now. And uh, you guys all say hello to Aviation360. Let me unmute myself on Discord. All right, 360, what's up, man? Nothing much. How about you? Good, good, man. Just finished the intro. Um, getting, the air, getting my engine started now. I went ahead and took off. Beautiful. Uh, let me know in chat if you guys can hear him okay. He might be a little low. I'm gonna have the engine sound pretty high because I just love it. Uh, but I can, I think I can boost you a little bit. So you should be all right. Uh, but yes, sadly, man, that we can't get it to sync together. We it's even fun. tried hitting fly at the same time and it, it just didn't work out. We spent about 30 minutes trying to get it to work. Yeah. If only we could have this scenery with, with DCS's F-18 in the carrier, mm. that'd be perfect. Mm. Facts, man. Trash Gamer, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Good to see you. 
Everybody's saying hi to you in the chat. Jake, Jake, Jack Bet Games, welcome to the stream. Yes, this is Microsoft Flight Sim. Uh, do you need this add-on to fly with me? No, you don't, Rudy. Uh, it's not in sync anyways, so it's a good add-on to have in general, but you don't need to have it. Uh, we can all meet up on the ground. I'm going I'm to try to land here. I'm going to give myself a couple tries to land on the carrier, and then we'll fly out to um, the Florida Keys area and uh, find somewhere for us all to meet up, and we can do a group flight from there. So, all right, we're also using, once again, Toby Eye Tracker. I uh, feel like I've gotten a, a good hold of how to get it to work now. Is good because it was really annoying me a couple days ago <laughs> but i think i got it going so engines are on now there's a couple things for those of you who do decide to get oh hold on as i said okay there it is uh for those of you who do decide to get this mod there's a few things you need to map so i'm gonna go ahead and taxi out uh, i was gonna look see if we're clear but there's nothing gonna come in my brakes on yep yeah, they are there we go all right nose wheel steering for one you need to have nose steering mapped. Am I? You know what? Did I? Uh, let me see. Did I? Are my rudder pedals? <laughs> Are my rudder pedals? Oh, they're working. Okay. Okay, then why can't I turn? Probably because my bar. My bar is out. That's what it is. Uh, my last bar should be up. There we go. So now I should be able to move turn. Yep, that's what it was. Yes, this is a free mod, C-Bar. Uh, what was I talking about before I got distracted? Launch bar. Launch bar. No, that was what I was talking about. Oh, yeah, um, oh. Uh, key bindings. So you need to have your nose wheel steering button bound uh, for the F-18 period. It doesn't matter what you're doing with it. You need to have that bound. You need to have a button mapped to a launch bar or something like that. Uh, you need to have a button mapped to... What's the other one? Oh boy. The carry just like move. <laughs> uh, and then also change aircraft. So that way you can actually spawn on the carrier Which if you want to spawn. Change aircraft is defaulted to F11. Thank you. Oh yeah, also you need to have the Top Gun DLC um, to actually get the carrier to show up. So, Spotting TLV, what's up man? Welcome back, good to see you. Alright, we're just gonna line up here. Now, here's the thing, the funny thing. You can actually launch from anywhere on the ship. Um, but to be realistic, you want to pull up to the launch bar, or to the launch uh, thing. So, da, 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 da. let's go ahead and unfold our wings, it's on our right. Another thing that the Super Warrior mod did is you can now open the canopy. Like so. And the default plane, for whatever stupid reason, they did not allow us to open the canopy. I think it's ridiculous. <laughs> but yeah, it's, that's how it is. All right. Uh, I think we're ready. Fly up. Wings are down and locked. Flaps down and set for launch. I'm going to set the parking brake. Yep, brakes are set. Now I'll turn the lights on so you guys can see us a bit better. Our formation lights on. That's good to go. Flaps are set. We'll do a quick flight control check. Oh, wow, he just blew by. I didn't even hear it. <laughs> <laughs> that sucks because I was going Mach 1. I guess because my, uh, my canopy was closed, I couldn't hear it. And then basically, yeah. we're going to go mill power. And then click on the launch bar button, I think, or the parking brake. Nope, that's not it. Nope, that's not it. All right, we did it wrong. There, there's a way to do this, and I forgot how to do it. Let's see. Let's go back. <laughs> let's go back. My brakes on. Oh, you know what? I didn't press the launch bar button. That's what it was. All right, let's try it again. Whoopsie. Also, to get your nose wheel steering into high. You can either fold your wings or press and hold the nozzle steering button you have mapped. And I'll taxi back over here. You can see it's really smooth. Like the carrier is moving. I don't know how they figured out a way to code this 
but they did a pretty solid job getting it to actually uh, keep the aircraft on the deck while it's moving. I know on, even on DCS World, you have problems sometimes with uh, desync and when the carrier decides to turn, uh, sometimes you can like fall off the carrier deck. Yeah. Typical DCS fashion. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. But at least the carrier is synced on DCS. Yeah, 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 yeah. Turn you down a little bit. Yeah. All right, cool. Um, all right, so, so this is what I think. So we're supposed to put the parking brake on. So we're going to brake. Parking brake on. Launch bar on. This L bar right there. Mill power. And then brakes release. There it is. And then pull the heck up. Gear up. Flaps up. Yeah, baby. <laughs> All right. We are born. That's cool. All right. There's a carrier. A carrier group. And we're just going to come back around and try to come in for, uh, what is it, a case three landing? Uh, the case three or case two? I always forget. I think it's case three. Just the, the visual, basically, the visual landing. It's not even a whole case, because we're not going to fly the whole pattern. I'm just going to do a piece of it. All right, so we we'll go ahead and put my uh, hook down. There's the hook. Here comes the gear. Oh, no. <laughs> what you do? What does that button do? Well, control E. I accidentally somehow pressed the respawn button. <laughs> and now I'm back on the carrier. Of course he did. Of course I did. Of course I did. So... We're going to do that again. To, what do you say? You just wanted to make sure your uh, takeoff abilities are 100% there. Yeah, we can, that means we'll, we'll get one more takeoff than the landing today. <laughs> uh, what's up, uh, Jake? Welcome back, man. Good to see you, man. Always good to see you, Jake. Welcome back to the stream, bro. Welcome back. All right, we're firing engines up yet again. Uh, make sure my bar is off. Bar is off. Well, at least I showed you guys how to do it, and now I know how to do it. And we can Don't enjoy the canopy. sounds of the engine. Oh, yeah, canopy, 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 canopy. Are you doing a flyby right now? Maybe. How fast did you pass us? Mach 1. Uh, you didn't boom. I didn't get a sonic boom. That's stupid. I did get the flyby. It sounded good. I just didn't get a sonic boom. Uh, Jake, yes, I do have American Truck Simulator. And uh, I actually I actually opened it up last night. Uh, I didn't play it. I was trying to get my mods updated. Alright, I think the engine's on. Go to, to, the, uh, to the thing thing. Come on now. Are brakes on or something? Yeah, brakes are on. Is there a train simulator that lets you go from Toronto to Ottawa? Sadly, no, I don't think so. Um, oh snap. Mike's vision. Hello, Blue. Great to see you. Hi, all in the chat. Hello, Mike Vision. What's up, bro? Chat says hi. Welcome back to the stream, man. Thank you for that super chat donation. There's another flyby for us. And uh, thank you for that um, that kind support, man. Good to see. Hopefully, you're having a great week. All right, let's close the can before we break it. 
right, canopy's closed. There's no sound for that, sadly. All right, so the way we do this is we set our parking brake. So brake set. We connect the launch bar. I should know this. All right, launch bars on. We go. We'll uh, check our. You know, we almost forgot the wings. There we go. That's very important. <laughs> Very, very important. Thank you so much. J Boss Life for the subscription. Welcome to the Blue Arrow Royal Family. Welcome aboard. Hopefully, you're going to enjoy today's stream. We're just getting started. You're just in time. You're not late, guys. You're not late. All right. Wings are down. Flaps are down. There we go. Lights all on. And mill power. I want to do this from outside this time. Oh, I guess the uh, the blast thing doesn't go up. That sucks. And launch. You're up. Flaps up. We're airborne. Make sure I don't press the wrong button again. All right. Looking good, looking good. Help me, Tom Cruise. <laughs> All right, let's try it again. So, hook down, gear down. All right, I will do flaps in a second. All right, there's a carrier. We're on a uh, left downwind for the carrier. Get my stuff reset here. I kind of like my VV zoomed out a little bit. Uh, our gear is down, right? Yes, it is. Flaps coming down. Man, that flap angle is just weird. I don't, I don't believe that that's the right flap angle. <laughs> I really don't. I don't, I don't either. I really don't. BBJ20, welcome to the stream. This is the F18 Super Hornet. Using the Super Warrior mod on Flex MTO. This is the uh, the same type of aircraft that was in the Top Gun movie, and we are going to attempt to land on the aircraft carrier. We're already too fast, and the LSO does work, so that we should hear a guy talking to us once we get a bit closer here. We'll pull some G's. We're going really fast. All right, and we should see the light also. All right, call the ball, Hornet ball. All right, we're fast. All right, on speed. Oh. Should be about 140 knots ish. Oh my God, my thing is like, my camera view is screwed up. We are very low. Might still be able to save it. Wave off, wave off. Wave off. You're low. Yeah, I don't know what my Toby Eye Tracker was thinking that last little se section. Rudy Salt, we are on the USA East server, my usual. Uh, oh, we're, we're still over in the in, group. In the floor. Oh, we're in a group, aren't we? Yeah, during right. testing, we kind of. I forgot, forgot to get out of that to get out of the group. Can we leave the group while we're in here? Uh, I'm not. I haven't been on this thing in a while, so if you're asking the wrong guy. Yeah, you're right. Oh wait, yeah, yeah, we can. If you go to the pause menu. I can't. Uh... All right. I left the group. You left the group. Well, I'm still in the group though. That's the problem. Yeah. So just hit your escape. I, I'm gonna hit escape. I'm gonna leave the group. And hopefully everybody can. See. Oh, I think the group is already gone because you left the group. There's nobody in the group. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Cool. So I don't know if it's gonna like now you can see me, we'll see. If not, I don't mind respawning and uh, we can meet up at another airport. That is cool with me. Cause I would definitely like to see everybody else. I don't wanna be out here by myself. Uh, let me know though, Rudy, if you, uh, if you can see me now. All right, let's try this again. We'll give ourselves some more space. We're way too close. And we're very fast, so I'm gonna bring back speed. Clouds are pretty low out here. The handling is just so different. 
than uh than DCS. Mm-hmm. Alright, turn in. Beautiful water color out here though. And uh the key area. Or the keys area. You actually see there's a the keys right there off our nose right now. So we're just south of it. Alright, let's get live. Really cool if it had like an ICLS too. Why my camera keeps moving up like that. If I see traffic ahead of me, um, or above us, I'm not sure who that is. Alright, gears down, hooks down. Let's try this again. I don't, I wish that I could turn off that POI thing. Like the uh, little icon. Alright, we should start seeing the light from the carrier here in a second. I do see somebody's stroke light over there. Oh, actually, I see it already. So I already see it. I think it's a red light flashing. Wants to be amber. Looking pretty solid right now. Remember the carrier deck is at an angle. There it is. Roger ball. There it is, Hornet Ball. LSL's working. You're a little high. I'm not waving off. Did we make it? Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, there's another person on my carrier. How? I don't know how. <laughs> how did that happen? Just by luck. There's another person on my carrier. Alright, uh, wings up. Who is that? In the uh, blue Microsoft Flight Sim F-18. Alright, we made it somehow, by some miracle. Uh, he tried to wave us off. We tried to wave off, and uh, I caught a hook. It's pretty forgiving. I gotta be honest with you. It's, it's very forgiving. All right, I'll take uh, Cat One. I, I I was too low. If this was DCS, I would have smashed the the butt of the deck, and we would have died. All right, so it looks like you can't even use this one because there's stuff in the way. So we'll wait for this guy. Right, I'm gonna try to do one more attempt. I don't know how he got in my carrier. I'm very impressed. <laughs> I'm extremely impressed. Here's his launch. That's cool. Uh, how do you turn the wheel in the F-18? You need to map something to nose wheel steering. So, oh man. Um, the way that works is, what's it called? It's called... What's it called? 360? It's like call, it's like it. activate nose wheel or something. Let me let me check. I think it's called set nose wheel limit or something like that. In your settings. Alright, hook up. Let's spread the wings again. Now my question is, I might stick around to see if we can yes. watch this guy land. Because if we're in sync, I want to see if I can watch him land. It's the key bind looking for a set nose wheel steering to limit. Okay, thank you. Yeah, set nose wheel steering to limit keybind in your uh, Microsoft Flight Sim settings. Cool. All right. So I'm before I launch, I want to see if I can watch the other guy land because somehow, starting TOB says pure luck. All right, where is he? Uh, yes, in real life, there is a button on the front of the yoke. It's like somebody else just launched or something. Sorry, not the yoke, on the joystick, my bad. I love the ambient sound of just jets flying around. If 
I can spot the guy, uh, we'll watch him land from up here. It's, look how detailed they man. There's like details in here that no one will ever see because they put this into a like a freaking game mode and not into the world. Oh, nice. Rudy says he sees me now. Yeah, make sure you set your um, sim to all players. Matter of fact, I'm going to go hang out on the LSO deck over here. This is where the LSO would sit. Over here as he guides. Oh, there's an LSO here. Hello. Doesn't have the screen like DCS has it, but... Alright, I want to see. Somebody come land if, if we're synced. There's also like a, uh, a water effect too. You actually see that the boat's actually not even going in a straight, straight line. Where is this guy? I hear people buzzing us, but I don't see the one plane I'm looking for. Most likely he disappeared because of uh, how far he is, but he should pop back up as he's on final. Maybe we can zoom in. I really hope this works because I want to see this guy land. That'd be epic. I see smoke over there. I'm not sure what that is. What do you guys think? You think we're going to get him? Think we're going to see him? My question still 360, bro, is how does somebody spawn on my deck? <laughs> I think just sheer luck. But like, I've been on this thing for how long we've been live? 34 minutes. Here comes a flyby. Wow, that's fast. Got the LSO yelling at me. Yep, LSO's like, get out of here, we got a plane landed. Um, I've been fly I've been on here for 30 minutes, so my carrier has literally been moving on the world map for 30 minutes. So it's nowhere near the original location. I wonder if you spawn in, like if you click on my name and spawn in to join me, you know what I mean? Like, you know, I can click yeah. on a person and you can like, it'll spawn you in that area. I wonder if it'll put, put you on the deck near the plane. I mean, near the Maybe. carrier. That might be the way you do it. Yeah, I don't Maybe know if this so. guy's coming back. I don't know where he is. <laughs> Lone Sheep are in. You're just starting to get into DCS, and your flight stick is arriving on July 4th. Uh, maybe I could show you around how to get started. You know, you know, what we need to do 360. Yeah. We need to do a like a training session, like a DCS getting started. Like we all just hang out on Discord and just like get a bunch of people who are just getting started and be like, all right, mm -hmm. let me show you some things so we can talk to a bunch of people at the same time. So I know a lot of people are just getting into it and they're like, all right, well, how does this work? You know, <laughs> like DCS yeah. is, is kind of intimidating to get into because there's a lot of button mappings, a lot of settings you need to know about. Um, it's not yeah, a right lot now. Of help. <laughs> yeah, well, right now there's this big sale going on. Yes, there is. So like, so now is the time to get into it. I, I'm legit about to stop waiting for this person because he never came back. I'm gonna come in for approach of my carrier, so. Yeah, he never came back. So we're just gonna launch and do a, one more landing for us. And then um, let us know in chat, where would you guys like to meet up? There he is. Yeah, I guess he's not landing. Oh, that's a Top Gun delivery right there. All right, let's go back to our point. Uh, let us know in chat where would you guys like to fly out from? Um, preferably a, a you know a, a base, like an actual airport that has a military airbase. Um, yes, P Pierce, this is a mod. Um, this, it's in the description, my friend. Uh, BBJ20, yes, as well. It's uh, on flightsim.to called Moving Carrier. Pretty easy to find. All right, let's go ahead and launch. So um, we have the parking brake already set. I think. Yes, parking brake is set. Uh, I'm gonna put the launch bar down. So launch bar is down. I am going to check the wings. I'm gonna go mill power. Oh, no, 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 hold on. Whoa there, whoa there. That's funny, we're like, we're just sitting here. My airspeed indicator says we're doing six knots. That's pretty cool. Uh, my brakes must not be on. Oh, that's my gear. 
There it is. Now my brakes are on. All right, now we'll go. There we go. No power. Wings are down. Flaps are down. And we should be able to launch now when I raise the brakes. There we go. Like somebody else just landed on their carrier. That was me. Uh, do the Super Warrior devs have a Discord? I don't know. I'm not aware. They probably do. They probably do. Just go on the flight since you know, they usually have a link to their Discord channel over there. Uh, you heard good things about the modded Skyhawk. Skyhawk. Is that for DCS? My is that what he's talking about? Is that DCS? Uh, maybe. I know there's an A4 for DCS that's really good. Yeah, there's a good A4, I agree. Uh, guns for Air Force Base, Montgomery, Alabama. Uh, if you have the mod, the way to spawn onto the carrier is uh, set it as your departure. Once you get into the sim, uh, press F11 or whatever you have mapped to change your aircraft. Alright, flaps are coming down. We're slowing down. Turn our lights on. Didn't do that last time. Hook is coming down. Gears down. Flaps down. Let's go. Uh, for head tracking, I'm using Toby Eye Tracker, uh, but it also does head tracking, and as you can tell, it works with my shades on. That's surprising. Yeah, it is actually surprising. I wasn't expecting that. All right, so we've landed once. Uh, it wasn't a good landing, but it was a landing. Uh, he says Microsoft Flight Sim. So I guess you're talking about, uh, is there a mod for the Skyhawk on Microsoft Flight Sim? I'd like to give it a look. I know they have a, a bush plane version of the Cessna 172, a uh, tail dragger version that looked pretty good. But I don't know much about the, uh, the, the, the default one. All right, here we come. Right, it would be nice if I could like zoom out a little bit, camera. All of in my face. All right, we are definitely low. Gain some altitude. How can I see through the glasses? Actually, very well. I'm actually starting to like wearing the shades because it blocks all of my um, lights in my room. My eyes are getting tired after a while looking into all these lights in here. It's more difficult whenever it's like dark on the screen, you know what I mean? Alright, my camera, I think it's my Xbox controller doing that. Alright, we're pro not looking too good this time. Not looking good at all. Are we high? Are we, yeah, we're definitely high. Yeah, we're high. Here, crosswind or something. Yeah, there's a crosswind. You're high. You're lined up right. Oh my God! Am I gear down? <laughs> no. Oh. We smashed it. Yeah, my gear is down. Oh my God. <laughs> no, I don't have the special Captain Canada glasses. You can't replace those. I always think that though. Sometimes when I watch it, like, how do you see <laughs> with those glasses on? <laughs> oh well, this has gone exactly as planned. <laughs> I legit did a test last night, and it was like the best carrier landing I've ever had in my life. Now the camera's on, and I'm just like, can't do it. All right, so check gear. We definitely broke something. Gear is down. Hook is down. Let's try it again. I should have just ejected. <laughs> You're right, bro. You're right. Uh, Alright, let's turn it in. I am. Um, I want to say I'm better at this in, uh, in DCS, but I can't. I'll be lying to you guys, and I can't lie to my people. 
I really can't. All right, guys, this is the one, though. I feel it. I feel it in my bones. This is the one. I, I had to show you guys a bad landing so you can appreciate what a good one looks like. So here it comes. All right, we got a bit more leading time. We're on speed. Uh, we're off to the left a bit, though. kind of use a throttle here now I remember when I made my Top Gun uh, landing vid challenge video everybody was telling me why don't you use a trim and you're right I should <laughs> so I'm doing it right now I'm using the trim All right, a little slow. All right, call the ball. All right, easy, small adjustments here. There it is. There's yellow. Roger I want to see. Roger ball. You're a little high. Copy. Oh, this looks good. Looks real good. Are right, we gonna miss all the wires? What? We must have got a four wire because we barely got stopped on this thing. Oh, look at the smoke. Air shell time. All right. Okay. Well, I'm happy with that. Hook up. Fold up. Oh, Nima, welcome to the street, my friend. This is the Top Gun Carrier. Um, it's Hook the moving the carrier mod. Somebody almost got on my, uh, on my carrier right there. All right, it's, so um, how about this? We are going to launch this time, and we'll fly off to the Keys, and then we can all meet up somewhere around there. Naval Maybe. Air Station down there? Yeah, we may meet up at the Naval Air Station over there. Yeah, I agree. You know what the ICAO code is for it? You know, I did, but I forgot what it was. <laughs> I did not tell you guys that was the one. I mean, we, we came in high, we did come in high, we landed very late, um, in reality, that was an unsafe landing, but compared to the other ones, much better, much better. All right, and right here, that's good. All right, so brake set, uh, unfold the wings, hook is already up. Lights are on. Uh, if you guys are wondering where the smoke button is, it's over here on the right, next to your right knee. That's smoke. So it's only in the Super Warrior mod. The regular Hornet does not have that button. All right, cool. I am ready. So I'm gonna put the launch bar on. Launch bar is hooked up. Have I ever tried DCS? Yes, Aaron Butler. Yes, I have tried DCS. Oh, that's cool. We're doing an air show later on. I can't wait to see all you guys' smoke trails. All right, so where are we going? Um, we need to find out what the name of the airport is. So if you're not okay. already in the area, uh, you guys can meet us at... It should be uh, at Key, West, Key West Boca Chica. Uh, uh, it's called like KNQS. Uh, Key West NAS. So Kilo, November, Quebec. Extra, that's where we're planning to go right now. Uh, Boca Chica Field. All right, so I'm gonna have my. Once I get in the air, I'll turn the smoke on, and you guys can uh, follow me if you're already in the area. It'll be easier for us to find each other, and we'll fly over there. It won't be very far. All right, let's get the uh, the old head tracker back on, and I'm gonna turn the smoke on now. All right, no power. Salute. Alright, we're off. Flaps up, gear up. Uh, how long did it take me to learn the F-18 NDCS? <laughs> I'm still learning it, bro. Uh, it's been years. How long has it been out? 
what, two years now? 2018? 2018, I want to say. 2018, really? Maybe, I want to say. That's what wow, I want to say. that sounds like a long. Look at, look at our smoke trail. All right, we're headed to Key West. Yeah, I'll turn mine off. Uh, been to Quebec. It's a Q. Sorry, K. Hold on, somebody's asking. K N Q X. Uh, if you're flying, you can fly whatever fighter jet you want. F eighteen, F thirty five, F sixteen, F fifteen, F fourteen. Uh, I don't have the F fourteen installed, so I won't see you if you're flying in that. But uh, bring your favorite, bring your favorite jet. Uh, what speed do you rotate on takeoff in the F-18 360 quiz? Uh, or, I'll just carry whatever that. Um, that depends. Are you light or are you heavy? <laughs> yeah, that really depends on, like, I usually start pulling up around 150s lightly, and it kind of takes off when it wants to take off. Yeah, that's not about right. I don't Is take off on land very often in F-18s, so. <laughs> uh, that's correct, Nascar. What'd you say? Is your smoke still on? Smoke is still on, yes. Oh, I guess he disappeared out of range. Are you headed north or south? I don't know. <laughs> oh, north. I'm heading north. North, north. I think we need to go south. Yeah, we gotta go south for the main station. Oh, wait, is this the wrong... Is this the wrong place? Yeah, the naval air station's south of us. Or not south. Um, north. West. East. West. West. It's west. West, west. Um, basically, I'm just gonna fly to like the kind of the, the key, and then just follow the key over there. Yeah. Be to the end of the key. Yeah. So I'm slowing down. Speed is three five zero and slowing down. Altitude. Altitude is Angel six. No, I'm at ten thousand. <laughs> uh, smoke is still on, just for vis visibility. Anybody looking for us? Um, I'm trying to stay around. This altitude, stay nice and low. Uh, why do all the other F 18s show up at 787s on your screen? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. I don't know, my friend. I don't, of all planes, why do they show up at 787s? Barcos, that sucks. That's funny though. That's hilarious though. I can imagine just a bunch of 787s flying in formation. Doing like, so yesterday, I was doing some testing for this mod, and I was like, you know what, I, I have the F-35 mod as well, and I wanted to try that out to see if I actually liked it. And I took off out of Nellis Air Force Base, which has a great uh, DLC uh, for it now from uh, Latin VFR. It's like, it looks like amazing. It has an F-16 Thunderbirds there as well. And anyway, I took off there, and I was flying around Las Vegas, and another plane, I guess, took off around with me, the F-18, and then another plane showed up, and that plane was an A-330. And he was doing like all kind of like barrel rolls and stuff. I was like, what is he flying? It was hilarious. But um, those F 18s are secretly F or B 787s. Alright, uh, where are you at, 360? Uh, just flying, on the, flying along the keys. Are you... Do you have your smoke on? Yes. What's your altitude? Well, it's, oh, I see you now. You're coming up on my right. Coming up on your right? Yeah. Or you're coming up on my right? No, you're coming up on my right. Because the plane I see ahead of me does not have a smoke on. Smoke on? Turn it on real quick. It's not. It's on. No, that's not you. Are you banking right right now? Rock your wings for me. Yeah, it's not you. Tried. Yeah, it's definitely not you. I think you're the one behind me. Yeah, I do. Right, uh, oh wow! Look at that. Here, he oh, he disappeared. I think you're the one above me, maybe. Yeah. Hey, I'm at Angels Five now. Joris VW, you just bought Flight Sim, bro. Welcome to the community, my friend. I really hope you enjoy it. I think we overshot it. Did we? Yeah, maybe so. Uh, oh yeah, because this is Key West right here. Yeah. Unless, it, unless this is Mar No, you know what? It's farther out. This is Marathon right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah Key West is all the way at the end of the chain. 
We can do a low pass on keep on a uh, marathon real quick. Here. Uh, another thing about the Super Warrior mod is that you no longer have to use a key to turn on the afterburner. In the default plane, I'm not sure if it's how it is in real life, but in the default plane, in the Super Hornet, you have to turn on, you have to click on the afterburner button to go in afterburner. Explain it's automatic in Super Warrior. Today. Yeah, this is marathon. Alright, so this is going to follow, I think this is what Highway 1 is what they call it, right? That's the Locals in chat, let us know. Any Floridians here? Any, any Floridians here? I know we do have some. Got a text message. people coming they're supposed to like fix something in the house and I was like you know what they're probably gonna come when I'm streaming I bet always all right following the keys go outside oh, I froze Bro, you know it'd be freaking epic if we could figure out how to do the uh, what do you call it? Uh, it's like an aerobatic move that like literally every aerobatic team does, where they make like a flower in the sky. You like fly in different directions. Mm, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I'm not talking about. It's like a big burst. I don't know what it's called. I don't know what it's called either. Uh, Nemon, the fuel tanks underneath the aircraft is a mod for the Super Warrior. Um, it's not in the default plane. You have to have the Super Warrior mod to get it. And all you got to do is just basically add fuel to your aircraft and it appears. Yes, the Starburst was called. Yeah, I don't know if we can organize it well enough to really make it. It, it kind of yeah, looks like it right now, a little bit, from my angle, even though we're not turning. Like, if the guy on my left just turned left, and the guy on my right turned right, and I just go straight, we can literally make it right now. Alright, I've made it to the Naval Air Station. Alright. Uh, are you that far ahead? Were you like full yeah, after the whole way? No. You're just full mill. Oh, okay, then yeah, I'm like 30% power right now. Wow. <laughs> XBAX finds it. Uh, we are on the USA East server. Yeah, it looks like a palm tree, exactly. The uh, Starburst. What's really cool is the fact that we can actually see each other's smoke. Like, I don't know how they figure that out, but that's really cool. I don't know how they figure it out, but we can't figure out how to sync the carriers. Right? <laughs> well, I mean, that's... Yeah, that's a little something different. That's a bit right? different because it's not the same yeah. people who made that. Uh, the yeah. Super Warrior does come with its own carrier mod, uh, but it's not a moving... Well, actually, no, I think one of them does move. I haven't tried it, though. Try that at a later date. Yeah, we'll try that at a later time, exactly. I think I do have eyes on the naval base. Yep, yeah, just up there. What is this thing? Uh, Grandpa says we need like five planes and all depart at 72 degrees from each other. Wow, man, you know what you're talking about. We probably need you to lead it, Blue Ice. Uh, yeah, whenever I, uh, the last air show that came to Houston, um, they gave us like the little like brochure. And, uh, oh, the Thunderbirds did? No, actually, the... Was it Thunderbirds? Thunderbirds yeah, it was. On, I think yeah. it was the Thunderbirds. Um, but they gave us, like, a, a brochure that, inside the brochure, it shows you, uh, uh like, uh, not all of them, but a, a lot of their maneuvers they do. And if you have that, and you have DCS, you can kind of, like, try to, uh, mimic it. It doesn't teach you how to do it, per se, but at least tells you, like, the names of them, and shows you what they look like. Yeah, so you can go on Google, and then... And Nathan says it's called US-1. That's what the name of this highway is right down below us. I knew we had some people from Florida rocking with us today. What's up, Nathan? Hope you're doing well, man. Speaking of Nathan, bro, I, th I sent you a text already. You didn't reply to me. But um, I know you're busy. 
Um, but I'm thinking about getting back in a Star Citizen. Uh, like actually not thinking about it, I really want to get back. <laughs> I don't know why, something, I think it's the new uh, Star Leak game that was announced uh, that made me want to try Star Citizen again. Because Star Leak is very similar in concept the way they're making it. It's another role play RPG space exploration game, which is probably going to be much more user friendly <laughs> than Star Citizen is. I'm not sure when it's coming out, but I am interested. All right, so there's our airport right there. There's a lot of runways. I don't know which one to pick. Which one are you on, 360? Uh, I don't. I can't turn my plane right now, so. Oh, you're flying, actually. Yeah, um, flying. let's land. Is this autopilot trying to fight me? Uh, let's land the one Man, that's kind of. How do you turn of... autopilot off? Uh, the oh! autopilot disconnect button if you have it mapped. Or click on AP on the um, middle screen. Thank you so much, Motonaut, for the follow. Welcome to the Blue Arrow family. It's good to see you, my friend. Welcome aboard. All yeah, right, I y'all just follow me. I don't know where we're, I know we're gonna land probably the opposite direction that we're going right now. So we're on a left base right now. Sorry, not base. Left downwind for the runway we're gonna land on. So bring the power back. Speed brakes out as well. So slow down. Yes, Starfield is what it's called. Thank you, Motonaut. I always forget the name of it. I call it something different every time I mention it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I saw the preview for that, and I was like, this looks dope. This is like everything I want Star Citizen to be. <laughs> All right, I'm bringing the speed brakes in. We don't need a hook for this landing. You can hear the speed brakes. And I'm probably gonna overfly Key West on the way in. I don't think I have scenery installed right now for Key West. Like, um, like custom scenery. I think it's just default. I actually, I think I have scenery from, is it FS Stream Team? I can't remember who it is, but I can't update it. And I can't download it again because the way they have their their stuff set up, like you, you get like a code that expires and all that stupid stuff. Yeah, I don't like that. Like somebody overshot us. All right, I think we're good enough. Let's go ahead and turn our base. Man, beautiful out here. Only thing we're really missing, like the, the the ocean color is kind of nice, but you don't really get the the see-through feel that you want to get out here in the Florida Keys because it's all shallow water. Yes, I am using the Toby Eye Tracker. So a big shout out and thank you to Toby. For uh, providing me with it. All right, here comes the gear and the flaps. Land lights are already on. We're landing. Man, it's gorgeous out here. Uh, Iko code. Can somebody drop it in the chat? I already forgot. And I'm also flying. And if I have any mods, can you take care of our favorite bot in the chat as well? Yeah, All right, here you come. I don't know how should take care of. We're a little fast. Key brakes coming out. Need my heads up display. I know, Let's man. That, I don't know how they would fit, get that to work, but a heads up display would be dope. There's a lot of aircraft um, and even helicopters that actually depend on that, so it'd be nice to have that. What, we, what would really be cool is night vision goggles. Yeah. Uh, there, there used to be like a mod that does it kind of but you gotta do like a lot of like extra stuff that I don't feel like doing so I, I never really got into it all right here comes our landing we are fast I see a uh, f-18 holding short for us oh buttered it in the f-18 a little bit of a bounce there, but it is okay. Our nose wheel steering button is on. It's gonna activate here in a second. I need to turn it off. How do I turn it off? I don't know how to turn it off. That's okay. All right, we're down. All right, we're gonna use our speed brakes and pulling back on the stick to get us a stop. There are no reverse thrust on the F-18. I think we're runway two two. I don't know what way I landed. I should have looked at it when I landed. That's a carrier landing. 
<laughs> I honestly was expecting to smash it down, and I was gonna say it's okay if you smash it down an F-18. That's that's what it's made for. Butter is not required. It's ideal, but not required. It's ideal, but not required in F-18. Oh, somebody's here. You probably should turn your smoke off. Am I smoke too long? I think so. Yeah, it is. And there's someone else laying. I think it's known but Frank Hog, at least at DCS. It probably is. So I'll turn my smoke off while we're on the ground. We don't need it. And we'll make a left turn here. And apparently the person who's supposed to be fixing something in my house is here. So I gotta go let them in. Uh, but again, we are at KNXA, right? I think that's where we're at. And we get back. Maybe. We'll do some uh, some uh, flying, some formation flying around the the uh, Florida Key area. I didn't hear a doorbell ring either, so I'm not sure what's going on there. But I'm gonna have to step away just for a second, guys. Sorry about that homeowner problems. <laughs> camera off I'll leave you guys with some dope music I don't do be right back screens because we always own all right I'm just gonna park it here for now USA East server East server
All right, I'm back. Sorry for that, guys. All right, cool. All right, you know I don't like to step away during live streams. <laughs> um, but the thing is, when I have these headphones on, I hear nothing. So I had a couple of, of the builders at the, at the door. I didn't hear them ring a the doorbell or knock or anything. Um, but you know, this book, just if you didn't know, I just moved into a new home. Uh, super excited, super thankful, super blessed uh, to be able to say that, that I'm a homeowner now. Um, but there were a few issues that we ran into that we, we found uh, some poor building qualities that they did in a few areas. And uh, I went ahead and reported them and they were thankful. I mean, oh, well, thankfully they were able to come in and fix them pretty quickly. So, all right, we are in the F-18 Super Hornet at uh, Kilo, where are we at, guys? K-K-X-N-A, K-N-X-A? I always forget the name of it. K-Q, what, what is it? Let me, let me get it right. I gotta get it right. Get it right, Blue. It's K-N-Q-X. Wow, I was very off, very off. K-N-Q-X. Yes, that's where we are. Q-West. And uh, we're getting a nice, massive F-18 little group flight here. So uh, we have, I think we still have 360. Do we have, are you still here? Or did he leave? Oh, my mic was off. I'm still here. All right, cool. You're here. All right, so I need to find out which jet is you <laughs> so that you can lead the formation for us. All right. Uh, okay, were you ever I'm going gonna... to get working carriers on Xbox? Um, Man, I hope so. I really do. I really do. Uh, the good news is we're not on the carrier anymore. So if you're on an Xbox, you want to join us, come through. <laughs> Rudy Salt says we're all in 787. Seems legit. All right, uh, runway 22, guys. Runway 22. Here, you know, I'll put fuel tanks on too. I can tell me apart. Yeah, that would be very helpful. Uh, and so once uh, we'll all, we're going to wait for Aviation 360. If everybody can make sure they turn their smoke off. And then I want 360 to turn his smoke on. So that way we can uh, find out which is him. I'm going to hold here on the runway. At runway 22 and wait for you. Uh, so again, guys, we are at... i got to keep looking because I keep forgetting the name of the airport. <laughs> uh, we're at K-N-Q-X. I should just put it in like the chat. Let me just pin it real quick because I keep forgetting. A N Q X. Airport. All right, there's Airport K N Q X. I'm gonna pin that in the chat so that if you guys keep asking, you'll now know where to look because I'm gonna keep forgetting. That's who I am. Alright, and there it is. Alright, pin that, please. Alright, let me know when you smoke on, 360. I have my smoke on. I don't know if I'm coming across for you. Uh, I keep seeing smoke appear and disappear. Are you uh, on the runway center line of runway 22? Center right line, now? yeah. Are center you moving right now? Too. Yes. Okay, that's you. Alright, cool. I'm gonna come on your right wing. Better stay where you are. Uh, someone else has their smoke on. I don't know. I, I see. I'm going. I'm going for the F-18 that's in the middle of the runway. Yes, that's me. With There's someone else. I'll just go on. That's fine. I'm, a, I'm lining up on your right wing, and then the rest of you guys just go ahead and line up wherever you fit in. Uh, don't take off just yet. 360. We don't hold on. Yeah, I'll, I'll turn my smoke off for now. Oh shoot! You disappeared. I gotta yeah, find out what the distance is, cause here um, I'm gonna scoot forward just a little bit. They changed it. Like recent in a recent update, they changed the distance that you could be. Uh, for this exact reason, uh, for formation flying. Yeah, there you are. All right, so I guess that's as close as I can get then. Wow, that sucks. <laughs> yeah, that's stupid. That's like, you could fit a 787 in between us. That's massive. Yeah, I mean, you could. <laughs> you could put two F-14s in between us. Exactly, man. Exactly. So uh, here's the plan. Once we all get organized on the runway, um, I say we take off here from runway 22 out of KNX Q KNQX. And we just follow the uh, the I'm islands uh, as they head east. Trying to look at my map here. Yeah, as it heads east, uh, we follow it all the way up to the mainland, 
and then we can go towards Homestead, which is KHST Air Force Base. Um, we can maybe do some flying around Miami as well. It's not far from Miami, so I guess we'll just kind of fill it out. It depends on how fast we get organized, because I want to get some some time to actually like fly in formation and whatnot with everybody. So. Um, I'm thinking we go up to, let's do like 12,000 feet, not too high. All right. Uh, and let's not go mill power. Let's just go like, I don't know, let's shoot for, I don't know, 400 knots. 400 knots, all right. Yeah. As a goal. So between 350 and 400 knots, let's try to maintain that all speed. Right. Just so we don't like leave everybody and we can catch up if we fall off and whatnot. All right. Hold brakes. Hold on, standby. All right. Let me know when you're ready. All right, everybody, we are leaving. Um, make sure 360 will be the only one with smoke on until we get in the air. Once we get in the air, we'll all go smoke on. That way, if anybody gets lost, we'll just follow the smoke. And if you have all bad right. FPS, then uh, sucks for you. All right, hold your brakes. All right, hold brakes. <laughs> hold brakes. Spool to mill. Give them hold a few mill. seconds to be able to hear that. The stream lag. Yeah. Releasing in three, two, one. Two, three, go. No, I almost put it in after, but I'm just going to stay in mill. Yeah, let's stay in mill. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. Why am I not turning? <laughs> Toe brakes. Okay, there we go. I'm going to rotate about 150 knots. Rotating. Rotating. Two's up. One's up. Gear up. Gear up. Flaps up. Flaps up. Alright, making left turn. Left turn. God, man, that water's beautiful. It is. All I can see right now is your airplane, but I'm pretty sure it is. I like flying lead. You do like flying lead or you don't? I do at times. I like flying lead shots. when, yeah, when taking screenshots. You just put autopilot on and let everybody form up on you. You know what I mean? Yeah, I haven't figured the autopilot out in this thing yet. All right, lev leveling off at about zero six zero for heading. Copy. About five degree nose up. Uh, speed check. Speed check. Uh, climbing for three hundred knots. Copy. Three hundred knots. Now, what do you think? Should we go high or should we just stay low? Um. It's up to you. you I mean, I don't mind it down here. <laughs> at, uh, right, no, maybe we'll instead of do like, uh, like we were at earlier, like six thousand. It's just six thousand. Six thousand. We'll go to six thousand. I'm gonna come off the throttle a little bit. Got trying me. to hold around four hundred knots. No problem. I'm gonna go smoke on. I almost instinctively hit T for off throttle, but I forgot to, that doesn't do, do this. <laughs> fly the F-18 DCS too much. A moto knot, yes. I uh, I usually fly VAT sim. Today we're not doing it because of the nature of what we're doing. VAT sim would not approve. Um, I was flying into New Orleans yesterday, and there's a T-38 flying in there. I mean, you can right. fly fighter jets. It's just you know we don't really have a plan. You know, we're just kind of yeah. flying around. So uh, in our case. I didn't think we needed to do, need to do it. But uh, hey, guys, if you're in the formation of flying with us today, and any time in our stream, if you get a great screenshot, we'd love to see it. You can post it on the Discord. If you're not on Discord already, exclamation mark Discord in chat, and I'll give you a link to it. All right. Trying to hold the altitude and speed, but yeah, uh, if you look on the middle screen, you know where the usual autopilot stuff is. There should yeah. be a square box that says AP. When you click on yeah, that I AP don't... box, it basically turns on autopilot. Yeah. But then you also want to click on uh, uh, R alt. And it'll change to B alt, I believe. And that should activate altitude hold, I think. Yeah, but it also, I tried that earlier, but it engaged the heading mode as well. Yeah, you don't want to engage heading mode. Yeah, it, it engage. Well, this thing, for some reason, engages heading mode as well for some guys. Gotcha. Yeah. Odd reason. And we're climbing up to seven four thousand for some reason. Uh, and you just started doing VFR on Pilot Edge. You've been doing VFR training program on there. Oh, bro, I love the VFR cat rating system on Pilot Edge. 
That's how I learned how to fly VFR myself. Hey, if you had an annex, welcome to the stream. Neighborhood, or Night Wolf, welcome as well. This is epic. Look at all these friggin' smoke trails. I'm getting good FPS too. I'm going too slow. What's your speed right now? Uh, 420. Okay, that's what I thought. I was like, I'm not catching up. <laughs> I just happened to be 420, not for a specific reason. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good. All right, I gotta find out which one of these is you now, because I think they overshot you, didn't they? Some did. Yeah, that's what I thought. So this is you right here then. This past your Cat 6, congrats, man. Yeah, the Cat ratings on, on Pilot Edge. All right, somebody uh, still has the gear and flaps down, by the way. <laughs> Who was off to my left wing? You still have your flaps and gear down. I don't know. I did see somebody with that down. Trying to catch up. I mean, that, that flyby. Some guy's going vertical. Yep, I see him. Are you still at 400? Uh, 38. I'm kind of bouncing around. All right, no problem. I just want to get an idea. I'm coming up on your right now. Yeah, I'm trying to stay around 400 knots. This thing loses speed pretty quick, I gotta say. Yeah, it does. Yeah, so it I do see somebody with their gear down and flaps down on your left wing. That's, I don't know who that is, but probably should put your flaps in gear up. Uh, Grumpolion, uh, it's weird that you, uh, first of all, the Nellis Air Force Base by Latin VFR is great. Highly recommended if you like flying any type of military jets. Uh, it's a great place to kind of like base out of. But I personally didn't have any problems with Fly Tampa's Las Vegas with the Nellis Air Force Base. I'm not sure why it's causing you an issue. Um, I just flew there yesterday as well. All right, let's get, let's get this right. This is, a, this is I don't do this very often. You know, it, the way the throttle the handles point? is very different. Wait, your gear is down too. Me? <laughs> Maybe that's it's a up. glitch. It might be a glitch. Is my gear down? Look off your right. Yeah, it's down. Okay, then it's a glitch. And Unless the other my guy gear is down. Just passed his gear down too. So I guess all of our gears are down. I guess we're just going to chill out here at like 11,000 feet. That's fine. This is perfect. we got to get it trimmed out because yeah. you know, speed changes, the trim changes. Yeah. Sakir Mola, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Also, guys, not sure if any of you guys are Formula One fans, racing fans. Even if you're not, um, we're still doing the Formula One World Tour. I think we're on, what, Route 10 now? Uh... Toronto, I believe it's Toronto, right? And it's Toronto, no, it's uh, Montreal to Montreal uh, to, to London. London. I just landed there this morning. Yeah, yeah, 360 just did his leg this morning. I might do mine tonight when I go to work. Um, it's only six hours, right? Yeah, it's only six hours. I ran it overnight and threw pots top of the Yeah, top that's of the what I plan to do. Um, so it's a pretty short flight. Um, but also, the game has come out today officially, or yesterday officially. Uh, from the 1 2020 of the game. I've been playing it since Tuesday. Absolutely love it so far. Alright, can I get this? I'm really struggling to like maintain matching your speed. Struggling to maintain altitude. But your flaps are down, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, apparently yeah, all our flaps little... are down. My flaps are not down on my screen. Yeah, I love MSFS and it's little quirks. If only we could have DCS with the scenery. Uh, yes, Moto Not. We've been we've been flying uh, F1 track to F1 track. This is the tenth leg uh, for the ten, tenth race of the season. I, I have to admit I have missed a few um, just because I my schedule yet. has been crazy. But I do plan on going back and um, and doing them all. And again, you can do it all your own time. You don't have to do it for the week at the real races, but it's preferred. But if you're like just hearing about it now and you want to try it, you could always start from the beginning in Bahrain. Well, it's actually London's where we started, then we went to Bahrain. Yeah, you're right. We started in the uh, basically London, where Formula One first started. I like, guess like they're the HQ of of uh, Formula yeah, I've One. Been private, I've been flying private jets the entire way. Yeah, yeah. He's been flying private jets, seven five sevens, and I've been mainly flying the triple seven. And uh, 787, I think I took for one leg. I almost did the 350. Oh, now your gear's up. <laughs> uh, I almost did the 350, but um, I had an issue with my, the flight I was trying to do with it 
It was like it was a 14 hour flight. It was like just outside the range. Of I'll the be honest, I kind of cheated sometimes with the fuel. Hey, it's all good. Yeah, well, the problem is, like, I'm, when I'm doing those long hauls, I usually put pedal to the metal on the plane to get it done faster. Just up a little bit more fuel than you should. Yeah. Yeah, I'm hoping um, that Lewis, uh, well, Mercedes in general, um, will look better in this Grand Prix. I know they've been behind development-wise, so I'm hoping that they can compete up front with Red Bull and with Ferrari. I'm loving the battle between Ferrari and Red Bull, but I would love to get a third team in the mix up there. All right, let's see if I can find the right road that we're supposed to follow in. Oh, you're good. You're going the right direction. Yeah, well, I'm trying to, I'm referencing a map in the roads to Homestead. Uh-huh. There's like one or two of these that branches off. All right, we're gonna come down a little bit to probably on 10,000 feet. Oh, we're at 16,000 feet, I didn't even notice. Yeah, I didn't notice either. The scenery's just that good. It really is, it looks very nice down there. Up there, you mean? Up here, or down here, up there, you know, it depends what you mean. Up here in the sky, <laughs> down here in the US. <laughs> B check? Uh, 450. I'm gonna come out oh, the throttle. Oh, my left. I'm looking good with this guy over here. 450, you said? All right. Yeah, I'm, I'm coming off the throttle. I'm just a little fast because I'm descending at like negative 4,000 feet per minute. Mm. Yeah. <clears throat> no spoilers. I'm <clears throat> sorry, in the chat. I haven't watched the, uh, the practice sessions yet for this weekend, so. What you about to say something about Stranger Things? What about Stranger Things? Have you watched it before? Uh, yeah, very briefly, but I don't follow it, so I don't. If you mention anything, I wouldn't know anything. <laughs> yeah. Here we are. We're looking good now. We're looking good now. Now there is, I believe, a few like groups uh, who actually do formation flying on Microsoft Flight Sim. There's on the Microsoft Flight Sim Twitch. I think it was there on their Twitch at an air show. Um, a few different types of aircraft flying around. It was really cool. The only thing they were missing... Well, I think they did have smoke, too. Now I think about it. Blue, you're off my right wing, I think. I am on your right, yes. There's another plane on the right that's going ham. That's not me. So I say, um, yeah, let's go ahead and land at uh, Homestead. That'll be our checkpoint. Yeah. And then from there, I'm thinking that... Hmm. I, I do want to do a dogfight at some point. Um, but I think I'll say that to the end. What I want to do is maybe do some... Uh, Air show aerobatics around uh, Miami area. Mm -hmm. And what we can try to do is fly in formation, but just like, you know, aerobatically. So, like doing flips and turns and things like that. All right, I have the airfield in sight. That's going to be pretty challenging. I know that for sure. <laughs> it's hard doing DCS. It's going to be real hard doing here. Oh, no. Rudy says you ran out of fuel. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, no. I think it's because you were, everybody was in 787s. I think that's what drained your fuel. I do not see the field. Or maybe yeah, I, I do, I just don't know what I'm looking at. It's okay, I'm following you, so it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, we can land I'm, in formation I'm, too. Yeah. Coming down on, probably down to 3,000. Uh, airport's pretty close. The, what'd you say? No, it's my in chat is asking how far is the airport. We're really close to it. Yep. About 390 and... Oh, I think I see it. So is this the yeah, one that's... Yeah. Is this connected to the Homestead uh, track? Yeah, it's right next to the Homestead track. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, we're going to overfly the track. I didn't realize that was an Air Force base. Let's get to the track. Or maybe it's like a joint thing where it's like civil and um, military. It's an Air Force aircraft. base. Kind of like, uh, what's the name? Uh, Ellington? Mm, yeah. My knowledge, I believe Homestead is a Air Force base. Speaking of that, you know, uh, Flight Sim Expo is coming to Houston next year. Yeah, I heard about that a few weeks back. Maybe pretty nice. Back here in mm -hmm. our hometown. Oh, I see the field now for sure. I see the, actually, I see the field and I see the track. Yeah. That's cool. They modeled it pretty well, I think. Yeah. From yeah, this distance, yes. <laughs> yeah, from a distance, it looks good. Yeah. What we need is somebody to make a. Uh, 
when I say somebody, it's probably gonna have to be me. I've always thought, you know what? If I was like a really good scene developer, I would go around just modeling all the race racetracks around the world and putting them where they're supposed to be. It's like where my two passions meet: flight sim and racing, <laughs> or aviation. I remember getting overhead break. All right, uh, I will break. I'll do a three second, no two second break after you. Alright, call it. Alright. Breaking. One, two, two is breaking. That was dope. That was real dope. Alright, coming to land, left track. Turn my stroke off. Alright, smoke's going off. And yeah, now we're low to the ground, be able to turn your smokes off so we don't lose a bunch of frames. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. Yeah, I'm seeing people glitching around already. Uh, somebody in chat says that it's an Air Force Reserve base. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure what that We're means, to be high. honest with you. <laughs> Navy what's, came by to say hi. What's the difference between reserve base and regular base? Who came by to say hi? I said the Navy's coming to say hi to the Air Force. Oh, <laughs> you're right. <laughs> yeah. All oh, right, this is an Air Force base, and we're Navy. That's yeah. True. We took off from a Navy base, though, didn't we? Yeah. Look at the some of these buildings down here. Man, this looks nice. All right, gear's coming down. And flaps. I am fast. All right, let's see if we can get some more butter far. delivered out here at Homestead. Yeah, let's hope I don't smash it again. Yeah, all this is photogrammetry, except for the freaking uh, track. track. Like, it stops. The line stops right here on this waterway, right by the track. Like, it'd be so cool to see the track and photogrammetry. There is a way to, like, download it from Google and import it. Um, but anybody got time for that. All right. Uh, what's my call sign? Uh, Stinger16 on short final. Right, runway, on the ground. Uh, runway eight, runway six. It should be runway six. Right. Somebody has their smoke on ahead of me. Not going to see anything because I let the smoke. All right, a little fast. Oh, we got a little crosswind pushing us to the left. I noticed that the vertical, um, the velocity vector doesn't um, account for wind. Alpha. Oh, butter, butter, yeah, butter too. I exited an alpha. Copy. I don't know what run, what taxiway it is. Oh, oh, towards the end. Not an F-16. Sparkle says he ran out of fuel on the downwind. What were you guys doing that made you run out of fuel? <laughs> I've been flying the same aircraft without reloading since we left the carrier. I think as I say that, I think I just ran out of fuel. I got fuel when we were at the naval air station. No, we're good. I didn't. I uh, do you know what the IK code is this of this one is? Mm, let's see if I can pull it up. Uh, the F-18 does definitely does not have Kilo the largest Hotel tank. Kilo Hotel Tango. Say again. Kilo Hotel Sierra Tango. Kilo Sierra Hotel. Kilo, Ho Tango. Kilo Hotel Sierra Tango. Tango. Kilo Hotel Sierra Tango. If you guys crashed, load up at that airport. Uh, I'm gonna take off from the runway we landed on. Hey HST, and uh, make sure you, everybody refuels and add full fuel. <laughs> Maybe that's probably why. I think they loaded up with 50% fuel. That's gotta be it. It's gotta be. All right, speed brakes back. And uh, this time, what I think we can do is uh, formation again, except we'll try it like aerobatics wise. So you can lead the aerobatics. Uh, we can do like a, a maybe not so much a barrel roll, but like uh, what do you call a thing where you do like the big loop? Uh, I call it a loop. Yeah, let's do the loop. We'll try the loop. Um, I think we should do it. You wanna do it here? Or do you wanna do it like at Miami? 
Miami, probably. Okay, I'm so dead. But Miami, you know, why not? You know, why not? If people are on VATSIM and connected to the Microsoft network, they're going to be pretty pissed, but I don't care. Um, yeah, let's go to Miami, and we'll use, like, one of the main runways as a reference for whenever we do our loops, so we can come back and, like, line up. You know what I mean? You know how yeah. it goes, so we'll do that. So basically, I feel we'll sorry the... for whoever... Go you go. No, go ahead. You go. Okay. I feel sorry for whoever's flying a VATSIM and sees a bunch of 787s doing loops. <laughs> So true, so freaking yeah, true. Because honestly, I'm the person who does that. Like whenever I fly VATSIM, I leave my Microsoft traffic on. Um, because when I stream, I want, you know, in case somebody's on Xbox, they can't or they don't want to fly on VATSIM, I still want them to have the opportunity to fly with me in my stream. And so I'll leave uh, how I have VATSIM model matching traffic on, and then I'll also have my Microsoft multiplayer. So if someone happened to be at an airport I'm landing at just doing aerobatics, like, I would see that. And so, if you're in Miami right now, that's what's about to happen. Miami is about to get an air show. <laughs> um, oh, if, they have 2.30 on the landing. That's not bad. Also, if you just want to plane spot us, it's, it's going to be fun to watch. Um, I was doing it just, was it a couple days ago, watching 360 fly around Reno, just watching him oh, fly. Yeah. It was so cool to just hear and see. And we actually did something like this before in D.C. a while back. Uh, where we could see all the uh, everybody was flying around doing stuff. So, uh, no, I don't have any payware airports here except for Miami International. I think I have uh, who made that one? I think Latin VFR made Miami yeah, International. Yeah, I have that one too. Um, so yeah, that's the only payware scenery I'm using. Everything else we've flown to today has all been just default scratch. I, I guess this is our runway because everybody's turning here. Yeah, I'm I'm here at the end. The whole short okay. run. Gotcha. I'm gonna line up and then I'll get some, uh, some fuel. Uh, if you want to add external tanks, if you have the F-18 Super Warrior mod, again, it only works for the Super Warrior mod, not the default Hornet. Uh, if you want the Super Warrior mod, the link is in the description. It's free. But um, basically, all you gotta do is just add full fuel. I'll show you here in just a second because I'm gonna do it myself. Um, to reload, I'm gonna stop right here so he doesn't disappear. All right, break song. I got, I got another screenshot for us. Wait, boy, well, he needs a livery up in his mug. Um, all right, so I'm gonna go up top to the weight and balance or the fuel menu, and then all you need to do is go to fuel and just basically, you know, hang on a second, I'll be out. right back. Just max it out. So I can show you what happens. So if I remove the fuel tank, fuel tanks, they disappear. So just like that. I don't know if you can see them in multiplayer. So far, I haven't been able to see anybody else with fuel tanks. For a default airport, that control tower does not look too bad. Yeah, pretty cool. They also, I think, I'm not sure they have them yet because they just, this mod got taken down for a while, um, but it just came back up. I'm not sure if they added liveries for it just yet because it's a standalone plane now. It's no longer just a, an add-on mod to the default F-18. Now it's a standalone aircraft, which is very nice. I like that they did that. All right, so once 360 gets back, we will take off. As I said, we're going to take off. Uh, we're going to head towards Miami International Airport, KMI-8. And we'll do some some formation aerobatics over there. We're going to attempt to. We are not... Listen, we are not a professional aerobatics team. It's only two of us on the mic. You know, none of us usually fly together. <laughs> so it's going to be super sketchy. Uh, basically, at the end of the day, we're probably going to screw up and just start doing our own thing around the airport. And then... After that, I want to attempt to do a dogfight with a 360. So that's the plan. <laughs> what, what, who am I 1v1? 1v1, merge. No, probably not going to merge because we're going to lose sight of each other way too easy. Um, yeah, not, not DCS. We'll just basically right, chase each other. Yeah. yeah, I had to go step out and check on something. You're all good. All right, we're all lined up behind you on the whole short, ready to go. So let's go ahead and line up on the radio on the uh, runway. All right. Yes. 
Agreed, agreed. Uh, definitely, if you guys are into, into, into military aircraft of any type, um, go check out the uh, Nellis Air Force Base from Land of VFR. It's uh, probably, oh, well, actually he has two now. He has Nellis Air Force Base, and he also has Miramar. Uh, now there's a free version of Miramar that comes with Microsoft Flight Sim now, but the one that landed via VFR made is so much better. So if you're really into military mil sim type stuff and you really want to take it to next level, get both of those um, secret the, packs. Or the next next level will be going to DCS. Yes, and then the next next level is uh, come to DCS with us. Um, this is a good time to promote our Blue Arrow Force. So we have a, a growing, a new growing uh, um, so a DCS squad we're trying to kind of organize uh, called the Blue Arrow Force. Uh, some of you guys who have watched our DCS streams are aware of them. We have liveries for the F-18 Hornet, the F-16 Viper, the A-10 uh, Warthog, and the F-14 Tomcat. Yeah, and um, a lot of them made by Aviation 360. So I definitely made it, I come made all of them by, except the F-18. Yeah, all of the F-18 he made. Um, so yeah, come come over there. We have all the liveries for free for you guys. and uh, We try to teach each other as much as we can, but at the end of the day, it's all about just having fun and flying together. Uh, every, games are just more fun with people, with other friends, and being able to learn from each other, things like that. So that's the idea. Yeah. All right, we are on the runway, and we're ready. I'll drop an invite in the chat for that. Yeah, you can drop it on there. Hopefully Nightbot doesn't have an aneurysm. All right. Hold brakes. Holding brakes. Going to mill. No power. All right, rep mill. All right, three, two, one, release. All right, two's released. And two's rolling. Okay, we're gonna rotate about 150 knots. Got me. So far, I see we're at five to six. All right, and two's up. Gear up. Gear up. up coming up. I can't wait for them to add wake turbulence. Oh, unrestricted climb, okay. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't tell me about that. I didn't tell you about that either. I'm no, already no. stalling, I'm not gonna make it. Yeah. I didn't have enough power. Getting those down. <laughs> I wish you would've told me we could do un un unrestricted climb. I probably should've, I probably should've mentioned Yeah, that. I'm stalling, that's Next it, that's a wrap. Yeah, I'm, I'm stalling too. I'm gonna, I'm gonna spin. <laughs> it might die. Oh, I don't know if I can save it. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. All right. Well, that that was a fail. Um, yeah, that was a fail. Now I gotta find you again. Okay, so everyone else turn your smoke off. Everybody smoke off. I will leave mine on so you can find me. Mine is on right now. Okay then. We're gonna follow the coast back up to Miami. All right, I'm low over the coast now. All right, I'm about four thousand feet over the coast. Four thousand. I'm three hundred. Alright, so you're I'm, the high wind. Oh, you're way up there. I see you. I got eye line. I'm gonna pull up. I just need right, pulling up right now. I'm gonna speed up to about 400 knots. Try and hold that. I forget how cool the clouds are in the MSFS. Oh, yeah, they're great. They're great. Alright, I got eyes on you. Are you first in line? I should be. All right. If there's nobody in front of you, then you're first in line. We do have some clouds around the area of Miami right now, so be aware of that. Yeah, I might need to dip beneath the cloud cover. Yeah, and go underneath or above, either or. Yeah, let me just, let me check the map again. Let's go Let's above actually far. first. Um, All right. Yeah. Let's be... All right. Miami's not too far from us, so. No, it's really ahead. close. Uh, Neman, we're headed to Miami right now. KMIA. Uh, we're gonna do a little of uh, aerobatics show over there. And we're not going to be missing an action. We're not going to what? I was making a joke right in my head. Yeah, that smoke really helps. Because without it, I would not be able to see you. Oh, there's two planes. Huh? Let's see? All right, yeah, I'm about 30 degrees when I was up, headed for around yeah. 13, 14,000. I got eyes on you now. Down. What's your speed? Uh, climbing, or just losing speed fast. I'm, I'm catching come. you in a... Uh, All right. Oh, I was down. shot. Big, big time. Yeah. All right, we're going to do about 18,000 feet. 
Yeah, I'm there. <laughs> yeah, you're there for sure. Oh, right, well, that was me that is All right, over. Alright, Miami International off the left. Uh, yep, I see Miami. I don't think I've been playing much of MSFS since I got my 3070. Probably much better now. Uh, where oh, are yeah. you in reference to the... Oh, I see you. Are you here? Yeah, that's you right there. Yeah, this 3070 tonight freaking loves it. Yeah, Alright, once I we get really... grouped up together, we can fly in uh, to Miami. Alright, well, I'm like going really stupidly slow for some odd reason. That's fine. I'm trying to catch up to you. Yeah, we're like 200 knots. I'm oh, not catch up. I'm trying to get back over there. I overshot now. I'm trying to come back. Yeah, I'm just punching the burners to get up to about 300, 350 knots. This is so cool. <laughs> yeah, so what runway are you wanting to do down there? I don't know the numbers, but i um thinking about doing the left one. Like, the coming left. from this direction, from like, from the water. To land. So the, the, the southern mode? Huh? So the southern runway? I guess it's seven. Southern one. Yes, yeah, southern, sorry. Yeah, I don't know. I can't see the numbers from 20,000 feet. Yeah. Before, but we're on a USA East server, my friend, around the Miami area right now. About to try to attempt to do some aerobatics and formation around the Miami airport. If we can find each other again. Are you still in Burner? No, I came out of it. God, I man, this is... Cool. Yeah, right, I'm gonna make a slight right bank to come over the... Over the Pacific Ocean. Sounds good. Go ahead. That'll help me know which one is you. Am I brakes up? No, they're not. Am I now? I just lost somebody's no crew. I'm gonna probably level off at about like one or zero nine zero maybe. Oh, there they are. Yeah, sometimes I do notice that sometimes the smoke trails will just like cut out. Yeah. But eventually it comes back. So I'm gonna have to try to cut you off here. I so bad when I press a trigger, but it doesn't work. Alright, leveling off or heading one zero zero. Copy. Yeah, we're going to descend back down to 20,000 feet. Gonna try and hold four on knots as well. Oh, what the? What happened? Oh, it's not just like glitch. I thought, for a second I thought there was a missile. I was like, nope, that's not possible. Not DCS. <laughs> that's what somebody was saying in the chat yesterday, because he's been playing DCS. He's uh, one of uh, one of the viewers just started playing DCS, and he says now when he sees like contrails in Microsoft Flight Sim, he's like, oh no, it's a, he thinks it's a SAM trail. Or some kind of smoke trail. After playing DCS for a while, and you go to the military or what you call it, civilian. Yeah. Quite some you can see that. Like, oh no, I better check. Why are we can't do that? Yeah. I'm sure somebody would find a way to add. Uh, like, if they got smoke to work, I'm sure they can get like flares to work. Yeah. If anyone can figure it out, probably be this group of people who designed yeah, this. Yeah, I agree. I think if anybody can do it, it's the people who made the Super Warrior. I, I finally caught up. Oh, Gabe, servers are currently unreachable. Please check your internet connection. That's not good. Oh, no. Oh, that's a bad timing. <laughs> Hopefully that's not it. They're just kidding. Hopefully it's a joke. I want to say thank you to all you guys flying with us today. You guys look great. look amazing. All right. Um, all right. Ready uh, for I am in? finally caught up. Is that the Bahamas? What is that off our nose? That is, uh, that is part of the Bahamas. I think that's, um, uh, what's it called? What's the name of it? Hang it. I don't know. Grand Key or something? Hold on, I can find no, it. Just keep keep it's flying Alice straight Town. for a second. It's Alice Town. In North Bimini. Alice Town? Yeah, so I think it's South Bimini Airport or something like that. Gotcha. I don't know. Alright, I'm making a slight return. Slight all right, hopefully, guys, uh, stream, chat, everybody. It seems my internet is being weird right now, so hopefully the stream does not end. Uh, and, and, yeah, I really hope it doesn't. That would really suck, because getting to the best part of the stream right now. Oh, got me leveled off. Oh, it's so cool. 
can't believe we're way out here in the Bahamas right now. <laughs> These guys are better at flying information than I am. I'm struggling to manage my speed, my throttle right now. Okay, all right, I, man, we're on you. We're all here. So, yeah, uh, lead us to Miami. Yeah, I'm trying to keep this thing. I'm trying to get screenshots and this thing not fall out of the sky <laughs> at the same time. Oh, good. Let's see. No, don't get in that. I was trying to say earlier, I, I'm looking forward to getting wake turbulence uh, in multi multiplayer because uh, I did the Reno Air Races on the Microsoft Flight Sims Twitch channel the other day. And uh, that's the first time, besides DCS World, uh, that I've seen like wake turbulence like correctly modeled in a flight simulator, and it's so cool. So I mean, the wake of just those tiny little aircraft can be so strong. So I can't imagine how big the wake is going to be when like a 747 takes off, like a F-18, something like that. You know. So I know they've been right. saying that they're working on getting it into the sim. Uh, in one of the next sim updates, so hopefully so you gotta be soon. careful. Hopefully, there's a way for Vatsim to like disable that from the military because if you get on Vatsim, you got some sub four seven in front of you that just takes off. Get right. Of wake from, well, yeah, know, I mean, yeah, yeah. Hopefully, there's a way to disable it for sure. But um, yeah. I think in most cases, it should be okay, especially with Vatsim. Yeah. It's supposed to work with Vatsim AI as well. Yeah, if, I mean, if it works with Vatsim, the way I would see it is that it should disable the. The wake turbulence for like the in-game multiplayer, so you don't get blasted by a 747. Yeah. That isn't on the network. Yeah. You know something else All we right. need a Microsoft Flight Sim? We need um, uh, what's it called? Dang it. All right, you're gonna start spectator those down. mode. All right, copy. We need spectator mode. I would think people would really love to watch this, like like on DCS, you just watch people fly around. And I mean, all you gotta do is just spawn in a little plane and just do the free cam. But the free cam is, you know, yeah, it's tough to Man. do that. I mean, you yeah. can. You just have to find the right speed. And as soon as you let go of your, like, you know, moving thing, they're gone. You know what I mean? So it's yeah, very difficult. The, yeah, I need a way. Yeah, I'm seeing what you're saying. You need a way to, like, be able to track another player. Exactly. All right, we're following you. I see Miami. Wow, it's like a little, like, on my screen, like a crack in the clouds. We yeah, can see I'm here. the International Airport in downtown. Yeah, let's get down you can low. See the cruise, you can see the cruise terminal as well. Yeah, if, you, if we can, let's get down like all the way down before we get to the actual city so we can go low pass over the city. How low you want to go? Cause like, go I mean, down. on the deck low. No one crashed, we're doing that. Yeah, all right, guys, it's time to get real. Right, let's see, make sure my radar. And we're not trying to go like mock speed, so we'll just keep like a, a, a nice man of speed. I mean, it'd be cool to do a fast, but if we do that, we're gonna lose everybody. You and I probably might be the only few in here that could maybe handle it. Yeah, I mean, there's some people in here who can do really good information flying, uh, better than probably even both of us. So yeah, I would uh, basically I'm saying I'm, so I don't get lost because I know that I would get lost. <laughs> like I'm trying to stay close to you as we get closer to the clouds, or I'm gonna lose you completely. Yeah, uh, as we're getting lower, some people probably should turn the smoke off. I don't know. No, smoke on. <laughs> smoke on. Yeah. I'm just saying, it's people lose frames, but I guess. I agree. On. All right, we're coming up on the cruise terminal right here. Oh, this is cool. Wow. Here comes the finale. <laughs> God, and that water is beautiful. Oh my God. Are we going all the way down? Let's go. Oh. We're violating some FA restrictions today. Oh no. We, we got a clearance for it. We got all the papers. Oh yeah, FPS, rip FPS down here. <laughs> it's ripping because of all the smoke. It's not just the smoke, it's the freaking photogrammetry and everything. Here comes the Carmel cruise ships. Oh, don't hit them. Are we going, are we shooting the gap? We are shooting the gap. Whee! Oh, that's so cool. What are we, the freaking Blue Angels? Alright, once you get to like, um, like midfield, on the runway, let's go ahead and do the uh, vertical loop. Yeah, my plane is flying like at an angle. I'm not sure what's up with that. Uh, are you still there? I lost somebody. Yeah, I'm, I'm coming up in altitude trying to find where we're at. We're up to the field. Oh crap, we're on the east runway. Yeah, we're on the other side. 
Well, I guess we're gonna do the north road, anyways. Yeah, that's fine. North road sounds good to me. I don't have sight on you. Am I in front of you? Uh, yeah, I think so. I, I'll leave the loop then. Screw it. Yeah, it should be runway. Or my two eight left. Two six left. Or a six two left. Six. All right. I'll let you know what I'm gonna pull up. Wait for it. Wait for it. All right, pulling up. Not gonna be super hard, G. Just kind of a constant. Make sure you go and burner for it, or you'll lose. Come on, keep coming, keep coming. Keep coming. 5,000 feet. I am angling for the runaway. I don't come out. You want to come off the throttle as you come through the top, though. Yeah, you're right. I should have done that. Alright, pulling the G's. Throttle back on. Woo! We made it. <laughs> nice. I don't know if you might stay with me through that, but <laughs> we made it. I'll do another one. You going again? Yep. Why not? I remember on DCS Aerobatic servers, we do all day long. <laughs> Just loops. Yeah. Just loops. All right, this time I'm, I'm gonna actually flip it and go the other way. All right, again, our aim point is two six left, guys. Two six left. <gasps> oh baby, we made it! All right, coming out of burner, and now we can regroup. I'm not sure where everybody's at. That was fun. Yeah, I'm gonna head back out towards the city. Yeah, I'm heading to the city as well. Yeah, if I have any mods in the YouTube chat, if you could take care of that, please. My my hands are full. What's no the bots? Get the bots. Take every day, every day. We just ignore them now. Not the they right just keep creating now. new channels. I mean, new, uh, new, new things. So I have to keep hiding them. All right, uh, where are you guys at? Flying over the bay. Um, by are the you cruise terminal again. by the cruise terminal? Okay, so I'm yeah. a bit north of that. Oh, I see. I see your lights. Yeah, coming over the city. Bad FPS. Coming that low and fast with the smoke on. Yeah. Uh, once I got once I got past the city and into Miami uh, International, I was fine. Is this you right here? Maybe. Breathe. I'm flying at everyone. I just did a loop, so if you see a loop happening, that's me. <laughs> yep, let's see you. I'm just kind of flying around. Us. Kind of clockwise purple. Oh, the city looks amazing from up here. All right, how about we do that again? Uh, we'll fly higher this time to avoid the FPS hit over the city. And uh, I want to see if we can do it together. I think we did. I just couldn't look back at the time. Yeah, here you want me to lead it? Yeah, you lead it. Let me go find out which one is you, though. I'm flying over the bay. I mean, we're all over the bay. <laughs> yeah, I get that. What direction are you flying? Like, towards the airport or away? Towards, towards the airport. Okay, so you're already heading back? Yeah. I'm, I'm, over, I'm over the ocean right now. All right, do me a favor. And oh, I see a few loops happening. Uh, yeah, I don't know which one is you. Yeah, I'm over the cruise terminal. I'm looking. Are you a smoke on? Yes. You might, not, you might not be close enough. I might not be. Yeah, I'm getting closer to the cruise terminal now. I'm flying towards the city. If somebody just flew past me. Nope, oh, I do not see you. 
Alright, I am over here at Cruise Toronto, banking left. I'm making a one. Oh, well, you know what? Screw it. Everybody's here. Let's just do it. <laughs> yeah, I'm right here. I'm probably lower than you. You might be, yeah. I'm just flying straight. Inverted. I'm just flying straight to the airport right now. Yeah, so that's you. Yeah. It's a, yeah. yeah. Everyone, you're going a little fast, Blue. I'm doing 315. There's a couple of us going towards the airport now. Yeah, I'm following you. And my altitude is 2,700. All right, I'm gonna shoot for the loop again. And I'm going full, full burner. I wish I could freaking flare. <laughs> possible here. Actually, whoever that is in front of me, I'm going to follow him if he does it. Oh, I can't see anything. There's so much smoke. Oh, I should have done. I should, you know what I should have done? Oh, hold on. I'm going to come back and do it again. I'm going to do a recording with my uh, replay. Don't black out. Don't black out. You got this, Tom Cruise. Breathe. Push some butt cheeks. Oh, there's a plane flying right now. Oh, that's funny. Is he landing? I don't. I think he's turned off. Ah, pull up, pull up, pull up! I'm not sure we're gonna make it this time. Nope, we're dead. Smash. Yeah, there's a, there's an A320 right now. It's flying. Alright, my plane still works. That's good. Yeah, that 320 is probably confused about what's going on. Hey, what is going on? Where are all these 787 flying around? <laughs> I think what it is, is if you don't have the Super Warrior mod, you might be yeah, getting a model match problem. That's probably what it is. I, I'm going to turn on my replay mode so I can watch my aerobatics that I do. Ooh, fun stuff. I gotta step out in the cockpit real quick. Alright. Here we Actually, this is what I'm gonna do, guys. I'm gonna land in Miami, and we're gonna regroup and do it one more time. And I'll start the replay from there. Uh, same runway, two six left. Oh, runway. <laughs> oh, there it is. This is runway. All right, we're we coming in. Coming in for landing. And smoke off. Flaps down, gear down. Hey, why am I gear not down? Did I break my gear? Uh oh, I think we broke the gear. No, here it comes. Oh, that's screw too fast. He rakes out, flaps out, gears down. Runway's in sight. It's a bit windy in Miami today. Oh, there is an A320 right there. <laughs> yep, got a bit of a crosswind. And and there it is. And a seven four seven here too. Uh, when am I gonna stream Transcend World Two again? Uh, I don't necessarily have plans on when exactly. Uh, I try to look ahead at my schedule what i'm going to stream and when or whatnot and i don't know when my next tsw stream is going to be uh, i did do a stream a, two, a couple weeks ago on the train some world 2 youtube channel which is really cool so I'm super thankful for that opportunity
Um, but I might be posting that recording on my channel sometime soon. I just need to get a new thumbnail for it. All right, so I'm gonna let it roll to the end of the runway. We'll turn around and I'll take off from there. I believe this is two six left. All right, I'm back. Welcome back. I'm just landed. I'm, uh, I'm, I told everybody I was going to meet them at the end of the runway so we can uh, kind of like reset. Um, the same one we were. Yeah, the same. Yeah, that runway. Same runway we were doing aerobatics on. What time is it? Like one o'clock. Okay, yeah. We'll, we'll do this. We'll start from here. We'll try to see if we can do a little bit of flips with each other. And then at the end of the day, we'll just do a uh, free for all. <laughs> this didn't bounce. Yep, two six left, we're right. But it might be easier for some of you to just reload the sim and just load up at two six left. Love seeing the co oh somebody's coming. Oh he's landing. It's me. Oh it's you? I thought you can do a flyby. Like, he's kinda of, kinda of slow. <laughs> Am I going to land on the moving carrier again? Uh, uh, probably not. No, because it's not in sync uh, with everybody else on multiplayer. It's just, it's more fun to land where everybody else can land. Uh, there is another carrier mod that's just static and not moving. And in that case, uh, we could have watched each other land. Uh, we did that last year, I believe. All right, I am on the runway. I'm going to reload. Or not reload, but read a... Uh, Get some fuel just in case. Honestly, what we should do is not bring the tanks since we're going aerobatic. And we can be lighter and more agile. Sounds good. Uh, enjoy your flight, Rudy. And uh, thanks for watching, man. Glad to have you with us today. Glad you're able to join us. Alright, I want to get rid of the tanks. So we'll do main tank. One through four. And I'm gonna fill up all the tanks. So no center line, no left inboard, no right inboard. So now we're full of fuel, which is like 60%. Nice. All right, cool. All right, I'll, I was almost out of fuel on those. <laughs> and I'm gonna start my flight control replay. So that I can watch it back. Ooh, negative one, negative two seventeen on the landing. Not bad. I'm pretty sure Volanta isn't accurate on the landing, right? It is or it isn't. No, I don't. It, it can be. All right, flight control replay is recording. Oh, you know what? There's a way. I forgot. There's a way on flight control replay to record multiple objects around. And I have um, not really tested it much, but I'm about to do it. <laughs> yeah, it's called enable record slash play multi objects at the same time. So I should be able to, it should be able to the... see other aircraft around me. I'm gonna see if it works. I've actually never tried it. Hopefully it works. Uh, I don't think it's working. That's okay. At least as long as I have my plane, we're good. All right, uh, we all ready? Yep. Uh, are you in front? Are you leading this one? Yeah. You want to try leading again? I'll try leading again. Hope all I right. don't lose y'all. So uh, let's do this. We're doing an unrestricted climb. We all know this now, all right? <laughs> yeah, yeah I'll, I'll be clear with that. Renew unrestricted climb. I should have been clear about that last yes. time. Taking off unrestricted climb, that is, basically means you're going to have to be in burner to even make it. Yeah, uh, so, as soon as we start rolling, full burner. Yes, yeah, as soon as we start rolling, full burner. Uh, let me know which direction, because we want to end up back here on the runway. Not on the ground, but like for the loop. Which way do you want to take? you want to go straight out, turn around, make a 180, come back? Uh, how do you uh, want to do that? We'll, we'll go vertical climb. Um, vertical climb will level off and just go straight towards inland. And then we'll do 180 out there. Okay, sounds good. 
Alright, uh, two is ready. Alright. Spooling to mill? Spooling Hold your brakes. Hold your brakes. Alright, in three, two, one, full burner, release brakes. Full burner, release brakes. And we're going vertical after this. Copy. Well, I can't see nothing, so I'm flying First on faith. 150. There's your smoke cloud. Right. Going vertical. And going vertical. Flaps up, gear up, guys. Oh, oh look at big. that. At big. Oh, wait. All right. We could have darn near did a freaking loop right there. <laughs> Nothing down. All right, I got to be a little bit over speed. for a stall. Oh, bring it back. Stay in burner. Yep, I did stall. Because <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know, I right uh, 400 knots. All right, coming out of burn now. I uh, I pulled up so hard, like I had so much more speed than you guys. Because when I when I rotated, I stayed low and gained like another like 100 knots, and then I pulled up. All right, I'll come back up on you. All right, I'm gonna stay about 5,000 knots. Copy no, on your list. 5,000 5, nuts. Are you in a dark star? Seems legit. <laughs> Maybe so. Yeah, 5,000 peaks, excuse me. 200 knots, 5,000 feet. <laughs> oh, look at these clouds are epic ahead of me right now. Yeah, I know. I, I gotta find too. you before I, uh, I lose you in the clouds. Where the heck I think did you someone go? Just flew, someone just flew by me. I, yeah, I thought that was you, but I'm pretty sure that's not I think you. you. I think I'll hop to your left wing. Rock your wings? Yep, I think I see you. Rock and wings. Yeah, that's you. Here's me. Are you behind me or ahead of me? Uh, I'm to your left. Oh, yep, yeah, I got you with the, with the, uh, with the gear out. <laughs> yeah, for some odd reason. Is my All gear right. out? Yeah, I guess it's everybody's just blowing up. past us because we're back here and air up there. All right. I'm but trying to slow down. Why are you going up. so slow? I don't know. It's just my game speed. Are you sure your gear is up? Yes, I'm sure my gear's up. Okay. It's not DCS for. Alright, I see you where, where are you? Where um, are you? I'm in the clouds now. You in the clouds? Oh, <laughs> I'm just gonna put it up here. Where are you? These clouds look so cool. Yeah, they do. Um, I guess we're probably good enough out to try and turn around now. Yeah, we're um, good. I don't know what, Go ahead and turn around. I don't know what they're doing. I'm pretty sure someone could fuse someone with the smoke. Yeah. Are we all, is my smoke on, too? Yours is off. It's on now. All right. All, all right. Turning around. Go ahead and make a hard right turn, and I'll know which one is you. I'm making a hard left. Okay. I got you. I got eyes on you. I'm following you. All right. Let's do this. All right. Well, like we're just we're let's do this. All right. We're going to go down low. Hope to God our frames don't... Bro, I got Go you right that. in my gun range. <laughs> I think right, FPS shouldn't um, be too bad coming from this side. Yeah, I'm hoping to eyeball this because we can't see the airfield right now. Yeah, I can't see. I was following your smoke trail, so I'm trusting that you know where you're going. All right, this is the deal, bro. After the loop, breaking oh, the yeah, dog fight. Right right. um, cat and mouse. I'm and the cat. You're the it. mouse. Oh, I'm about to overshoot you. Dang it. About 350 knots. We're going to roll in. Yep. I'm trying to slow down. I just going you. Again. My, oh, my speed has been out this entire time. That's why. I That's probably speed. why you're going so slow. Yeah. Uh, you're right. You're probably. Yep. Here. I'm trying to slow down. Just go ahead. Keep going. I'm going to go in front of you. All right, let's do it. Oh, that looks amazing. Send it. All right. We're just going to follow the taxiway. All right. All right, can I stay in formation? During this maneuver. All right, let us know when you're going to pull up. All right, pulling up in three, two, pull one. Burner. Going vertical. Pull burner. Pull burner going vertical. Like Yeehaw! Alright, start going harder now. Yeah, I lost you, but I'm still looping. <laughs> and 
and going back down. Yep, and it's hot. Cool. I got an aircraft taking off. Oh, that's so cool. We all came down at the same time. All right, going rogue. How style is on? I don't know which one is you. All right, I got to pause for some. I got to pause. Oh, we got to pause. Okay, I'm chasing somebody else to. Let's see, I'm gonna have to chase him out with a smoke on though, because I can't see. Oh, there it is. I'm chasing this person. Alright, dogfight time. Everybody's chasing whoever that first plane is in smoke. Can't get a lot. Oh, he's gonna make me stall. I I still see him, but he's got so much speed. What are you flying an F-16? Jesus Christ, <laughs> bro! That's like a freaking rocket ship going up right now. That's the mod we need. We need a rocket ship mod. All right, he's coming back down. I think I'm stalling. Back. All right, we've already started the dog fight. I don't know who I'm chasing. It looks so freaking cool though on on here. Well, it's hard to tell who's who. It is hard. I've just found, I've, I've isolated one person, and this is who I'm following. And chasing. I don't know who it is. But this is who I'm chasing. <laughs> Trying to get close enough for a gunshot. Oh, he slowed down. He's pulling up. He's doing, what are you doing? Ah, I can't look high enough. <laughs> My head's way up here. Come on, Toby. Help me out, Toby Eye Tracker. Oh, okay. You still use now then? What? So do you still use Tracker Arm? Yeah, I still use Tracker Arm. But not today. Alright, uh, man. About to break my neck. Alright, I still got eyes on him though. He's dropping down low. There's no way he's pulling up out of that. Okay, there he is. You guys should see, hold on, the way this looks in third person. Let's be race around. Noticed it. All right, where'd he go? I see a smoke trail ending right here. I don't know where the guy went. Are they chasing me now? Yep, they're on my back. Oh, don't black out. We blacked out. I could black out from the outside view. <laughs> Ain't my gun reticle, man. Are you chasing me? Is that you? Yeah, that's me chasing you. I'm getting chased by A330 as well. <laughs> yeah, I saw that too. I don't know if he's flying. He was dead a while back ago. Oh yeah, definitely. If, if, if there was actually guns, been dead a long time ago. I right, going if we're gonna fly by in Miami, but it's a dog fighting my tail. If I can break the radar lock on it, A320. Oh. Yes, this is Miami, my foofy.
All right, you want Supersonic? Blacked out again. Dang, man. <laughs> Dead. Shot down. Thankfully, I'm pointing up and not down. Oh, look at that. Look at that view. Oh my god. It's like Miami just like peeking through the clouds. Alright guys, I'm coming in to land for the final time. You know, yeah, actually no, I'm not gonna land. I'm just gonna stay in the air. Screw landing. <laughs> now I'm thinking like we could uh like like do they basically do the outro, they're in formation. You know what I mean? So like I'll just y'all can follow me. I'm gonna get up, I'm gonna climb up above the clouds and then head north. Can't see anything. There we go. Oh my God! Microsoft flight sim for the win right now. I really hope that the clouds and the weather on X plane can compete because this is amazing. Oh, Rudy, are you at the airport still? Oh, that's so cool. I wish I was on the ground watching this. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. You know, I forgot I was recording with Flight Control Replay. We could actually still watch. Actually, we might just do that. Yeah, take it back. Change my mind again. We're landing, and I'm going to watch the replay of our adventure. While we say goodbye. Oh, Rudy was the A320. <laughs> That's funny. I wonder who that was. Yeah. We're going to try and land on the <laughs> Uh, Robbie, uh, Ryan, we, I'm using Toby right now, Toby Eye Tracker. Um, but I also have Track IR, and I use that a lot too. Just, uh, I'm currently reviewing the Toby, so I'm using it a lot. Alright, where's the airport? Right, I got eyes on it. Alright, brakes are out. I lost sight of you. Yeah, I'm like in the clouds. I'm in a soup right now. Down yeah. low, coming in for landing on two seats left. Gain visual. Okay, I'm trying to catch up to you. Uh, I'm not gonna do over here. You know what? I'll, you know, since Rudy's on the ground, I'll do over here break. Uh, left traffic. Left traffic. All right. I'll try and be on. Get on your wing. All right. I'm slowed down. Speed. All right, Rudy. We're coming in for overhead break over two six left. AKA stage center. <laughs> Smoke is still on. He might not be able to see it. Yeah, I mean, if he doesn't have the mod, he won't be able to see it. You're right. Nice and low. Oh, I see his 320 right there. Alright, break it to the left. Right over the tower! Beautiful. Alright, I'm gonna go smoke off here. Alright, I'm now on the left downwind. Nose to the city. Smoke is off. See right. you. You know, I think I did all that with my gear down. Nope, there's those up. up. Alright, now gear's down. Yeah, I can't wait to watch that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to my uh, replay and I'm gonna watch it from wherever Rudy was standing. So I'm gonna see what his point of view was. I want to see like when we all came flying in. Sadly, I don't think I recorded everybody. I only got me. Um, a cool thing about Flight Control Replay is you can actually pull up multiple instances of the app, and it'll basically duplicate your aircraft. You can pretty much create your own fake formation flight. I might try it now. Alright, coming in for landing. Very fast, too. 
me a lot of wind here. Alright, we're gonna float uh -oh. most of the runway because I don't know if my gear is down. Yeah, it's down. And touchdown. Nose wheel. There it is. Man, I gotta say, I've, been, I've gotten some pretty good My landings at 18 today. Okay. Your gear was down the whole time? It was down, but it didn't come down. <laughs> Typical funny. in the best fashion. Typical. Alright, guys, welcome back to Miami, Florida. Hopefully, you enjoyed the, uh, the not blue angels flying over the airport. Hopefully, you enjoyed the air show. Enjoyed the uh, moving aircraft carrier. I'm gonna just kind of get myself off the runway and then I'm gonna run the replay back. And so I can actually watch from the ground point of view because I actually want to see some of that. I, la I landed with uh, 116 knots. Wow. I think. That's I don't know what me. I was. I am gonna stop right here. It is gorgeous, Mount Whoopi. I think it was a, a perfect area to fly around. Great suggestion, 360. Right, so I'm not sure if the smoke will be on whenever I do the replay, so I'm just going to turn it on now. And honestly, if you guys are in multiplayer right now, you're going to actually still be able to see my plane flying around uh, from your multiplayer. So I'm going to hit stop on the replay. And load. Let's see. No, let me change my setting again. Hopefully it saved that. Hmm. I hope it did, because that was really cool. Alright, all right, there it is. Open. There it is. And play. Alright, cool. Alright, so I'm going to hop out of the aircraft with my drone camera. Um, actually, let me make sure that the the uh, smoke is on. So I'm not sure if it's going to activate that automatically. Uh, it might do it because it's not letting me click on it. Maybe if I hit pause. Oh wait, you know what? I don't think it recorded right. Because... Yeah, it didn't. <laughs> that sucks. Alright, well we did not get a recording that day I, I pressed the wrong button or something either way it was oh, fun good. it's all good uh, we'll, we'll try again next time there's plenty of jets flying around to get a nice show but guys I gotta bounce we've been on long enough thank you all of you who for joining us whether you're just watching the show or, or flying along with us in the F-18 uh, super warrior again I re highly recommend this mod I've been looking forward to it coming back and it's finally back uh, if you're not a fan of the moving aircraft carrier since it doesn't sink with, Microsoft, with uh, multiplayer, there's also another really good one called the USS Enterprise that is a static, non-moving aircraft carrier. Uh, if you download that and your friend downloads that, it is in one GPS coordinate position, so you could actually watch each other land and stuff like that. And I'm getting some stutters now. So, but guys, thank you so much for watching. Mount Fufi, thank you, my friend. Uh, 360, thank you as well, man, for hanging out with me on voice chat. It's definitely much better doing it this way than talking to you through the YouTube channel, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. That was a cluster we know. Uh, next time we see you, we'll probably be on my, on uh, DCS World uh, flying a real F-18. <laughs> uh, or whatever plane we decide to fly on that day. But um, thank you again, man, for, uh, for that. Um, You're welcome. Yeah. Rudy Salt, thank you very much as well. Uh, who else do we have in the chat? Ryan Wright, thank you very much. Uh, Jake, the EMD, thanks for coming back out. Good to see you. Grump. Grumpolian, thank you so much again. I really do appreciate you. Vorba, thank you very much. Neman, thanks for chilling with us today. Trying to go through the chat. Sparkos, thank you very much. And uh, RIP for all those who did not make it to the end of the stream, who died somewhere in between. <laughs> it's all good. Leon, thank you so much. Moto Not, thank you very much. Mad Dollar Gaming, thank you so much for hanging out with us today. Um, Sakir, thank you so much. Nightwolf, thank you. Aviator Annex, thank you so much. Hostile, hostile Editor, 
Elder. Thank you so much. Zelman spotting TLV. Leo Sticks, what's up, bro? Welcome to the stream. Matter of fact, next time we got to fly with Leo back on DCS uh, in the 18 or the Apache or something. Nathan Burton, thank you, my man, for uh, hanging out with us. It's always good to see you. Hopefully, we'll be back on Star Citizen sometime soon. Um, yeah, hopefully so too. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully, I get my, my controls set up for that. It's the only thing stopping me right now. But, anyways, guys, I got to bounce. Until next time, remember you got three choices. Oh, how are you doing donuts? <laughs> Until next time, remember you got three choices. Give up, give in, and give it all. You got peace, love, God bless you. I will see you guys next time, next video. I am out of here. See ya.